Greetings from Galaxy Campers in Ontario, California. Today we're going to take a look at this brand new 2022 Lance 1062. Uh, it's got two slides on this camper. This particular model is being taken home today, taking delivery of this camper today. So uh, buyers are pretty excited about that. And just to give you an idea, this is their flatbed truck it's a ram 5500 so he's going to be doing some serious camping so anyway we'll take a look at this camper both inside and outside and uh, it's going to be a little bit quick today because the buyers are really excited to take their camper home all right we're going to take a look at the inside walking in you will see the dinette it is just the uh, regular uh, dinette that converts into a sofa we're going to take a look at it in a few minutes but anyway here are the drawers that uh, you uh, have to press this button to unlock it the drawers do come out pretty deep that's locked and that's unlocked very easy to see very accessible Go ahead and lock it right here now over here on this side you have your slide out and your awning light um, and as for this is for the uh, awning in and out and that's the light that goes at the end of the awning down below that right by your door are all of the exterior lights docking lights and uh, stuff like that okay moving backwards to the bathroom here is what's nice about this camper uh, so right now it's covered but you have the skylight as well as the vent and you have a nice big tub all right and as you can see with the flooring here uh, you actually step up into the bathroom and then but the tub you step down so if you're like really tall like me then uh, you can actually have a little bit more headspace. And on the other side of the bathroom, obviously you have a little bit of uh, space for storage. And you have two of these cabinets. You have your little sink. And this is kind of, this is, this is a dry bath. So unlike some of the other campers, uh, all of this stuff right here does not get wet when you take a shower and getting back to the shower you can see this uh, curtain rod is adjustable so uh, when you pull the curtain it uh, gives you a lot more room uh, to take that shower okay coming out of the bathroom right here you have your generator um, on off uh, switch with the uh, water pump and the um, indicators for your battery, fresh, black, and gray tank. Right next to that, you have this nice nifty little storage for all of your spices, canned goods, or, uh, well, you know, all of the stuff that you're gonna use for this beautiful, beautiful kitchen. Look at this kitchen. You've got so much counter space here with the suburban stove and oven with this cover closed you have a lot of room for food prep up top is the high point microwave oven and of course your three burner stove suburban three burner stove now notice that the uh, vent is back here instead of up top and uh, down below you have your oven you still have a lot of space here for your utensils and notice how far the uh, drawers come out so you don't have to reach under that's what's nice about these campers that Lance makes <clears throat> they try to maximize as much space as possible now this particular model has that new Truma Aqua Go so with this uh, switch you have instant hot water so it's tankless 
and this is a fairly new item for the 2022 models and I think it's gonna be here to stay so it's a nice nice little feature especially on those cold days you want hot water right away it's your waste basket and up top you have more cabinets and you have your queen size bed okay now off to the side you have the uh, Jensen television and the uh, DVD I think uh, Lance Camper is going to the JBL system anyway up top you have the speakers if you're gonna use the speakers on board this camper as well as the the uh, skylight which has the uh, shade as well as the screen and of course you know this opens up off to the side you have your closet which locks in place it's just a little tab right here and you have plenty of room to hang uh, some of your nice fancy dress shirts or not not big enough for a dress but uh, it's big enough um, you know for your wardrobe each side you have your reading lights as well as additional storage now I'm gonna go this way so you can see so this is the perspective when you're lying down on the bed off to the passenger side you have your 120 plug outlet and you have this drawer that opens up or cabinet uh, cover that opens up and of course you have your uh, ventilation right here and the uh, curtain uh, for privacy all right moving on to the Norcold freezer and refrigerator it's a really good size I think uh, it's very practical especially when you're traveling and you have additional storage right here in the dinette slide you have storage here as well as a little countertop right here and additional uh, drawers you have three total all right I think that about covers it for the inside let me convert this thing real quick so you can see what the dinette looks like when it's converted into a bed all right that's what it looks like when the dinette is folded into the bed all right let's make our way outside oh and of course you have your skylight on top as well as a fantastic fan and we'll go look outside so here's the outside this is the uh, slide um, this is with the slide that's out now as you can see there is an awning that goes to the back and you'll see that this this awning above the slide um, I believe that's still an optional uh, item but I'll tell you what I have one on my slide and a, uh, it, it does help a lot having that uh, awning in fact it's perfect because that space that you have in between actually kind of cools down uh, the camper quite a bit but uh, I believe that's an optional item and I think it's pretty essential to have especially having a camper if you're gonna go out uh, dry camping or you know just camping in the Sun in general so okay so this uh, particular one has the uh, Cummins I think yes it does have the Cummins Onan generator you've got this uh, big great big ultra deck plus deck pretty nifty and you've got a little bit of storage here this is underneath the uh, the um, this is additional storage to that drawer that's underneath that dinette and here is the other one 
So this is the uh, storage that can be accessed from the outside. And if you look in here, this is on the other side, that's that drawer that uh, can be accessed from the inside. So it's kind of cool that uh, they did this so you don't have to reach all the way in to access your stuff. And up above is your uh, battery compartment. All right, back here is the refrigerator, uh, back of the refrigerator, the furnace. Down here is the water fill, okay. And uh, notice that this camper, uh, as with all of the 2022 models, they do have the double pane acrylic bubble windows. So they're supposed to be a lot better, uh, better insulated, uh, much lighter, and they all open up, which is uh, a really nice thing. They're a lot easier to open up than the old uh, glass windows. Uh, so I really like these windows a lot. So here is the uh, Truma system, AquaGo, and I think, so this is just the access port. So you can access the equipment here. But anyway, this uh, new Truma system is pretty nice because it keeps your hot water um, hot. So it's an instant hot water and it is also your furnace. So it is a pretty efficient system. So as we go on with our lives, uh, technology gets better and better and better. But here is the propane tanks. You've got two nice size propane tanks. Okay, and so this is your uh, black tank access for all of your drains as well as your shower. Battery disconnect. Right now the generator is on. The generator is actually pretty quiet. It's a Cummins Onan um, generator. And of course here's your plug. And I think there was, yeah, that was it. Beautiful, beautiful camper.